Okay, so I'm just picking up from where Trixie left off in the last game. I have a feeling Trixie might not do any more videos for this game. We'll see, but I think she got a bit of a shock of uh, of how it was here. So um, I'll be continuing on, and we'll we'll see if uh, if she wants to join any more. So I'm just gonna continue from here. As Siri deals the final blow, the bunny girl is practically blown away by the force of it. Oh, bunny girl is kind of like a ribbon. Her clothes are torn to tatters, leaving her completely exposed. Ooh. For a moment, she just sits there on the cave floor, looking down at the clothes strap scraps on the floor. My, my clothes? No! Why did this have to happen? Extremely embarrassed, she tries to cover herself with her hand. Oh, that means her clothes are even ripped down the bottom. You didn't have to be that mean, you know. I, I know that I had to stop you, but you surely shouldn't have used such excessive force. A loud sniffle comes from the bunny. Oh, I feel sorry for the bunny now. I'm sorry, but it was necessary. If you had just let me pass, this wouldn't have happened. Yeah, that's true. You, you clearly won, you know. But then you destroy my clothes. The dungeon lord doesn't give us new clothes for months on end. Well, I mean, she sh sometimes you just gotta ruin clothes. She is so mean to us on the upper floors, so he looks back at me. It's only the first floor and I already feel like a villain. She lets out a heavy sigh. Is there anything we can do for her? Absolutely. I'll walk over to the sniffling bunny. She looks at me with the dewy eyes. Oh, come on. Everything is going to be fine. Oh, she's going to join our party, I think. I gently pat the bunny's head. She looks a little less upset. Head back to the stairs and talk to my innkeeper. She'll make new clothes for you. Ah. Oh, the overseer is going to get angry. A and she's really, really scary when she's angry. She'll be angry anyway. I'm in so much trouble. You don't have to come back. If you leave, you can just leave forever. They aren't going to be able to hunt you down. But really? She eagerly awaits my confirmation. Yes, just get out of here, stupid bunny girl. But, but are you going to stop them? That is why I'm here. Oh, the poor little monsters. Do your best down here. She immediately leaves, taking off far faster than I was expecting. Okay, so that battle's done. We won our first battle. One step along the journey. You said you absorbed part of your power. Yes, my power has been stolen from me and shared among the monsters of this dungeon. Oh, interesting. If we're going to survive, we'll need to reclaim as much of it as possible. Well, although I'd prefer to use my own strength, I'll take whatever boons I can. Alright, let's explore. Okay, I'm going to go to left. Straight ahead. I wish I could kind of... Oh, I couldn't see what it was. Siri, before we proceed further, I need to ask you a favour. What is it, Yummy? I know that you do not appreciate your position right now, but I'm afraid that we need to capture more subordinates. So you want me to catch them for you? Exactly! That's like Pokemon! While I do not agree with this idea as a matter of principle, we may need as many allies as we can get. What do you need me to do? I'll show you how to use your capture spell. Oh, cool! It should be a simple task. Show me how. Siri learned the capture ability. That was easy. All monsters you encounter around a while inside the dungeon can be captured. After capturing them, they'll be sent to your prison in your hometown. You need to meet your captured monsters if you want to add them to your party. To capture a monster, you must do enough damage with the capture ability to defeat her. Ideally, you should weaken them until they can be taken out with one hit. Not all monsters can be captured this way, but there may be other means of recruiting monsters. Oh, cool! Monsters who are high level in the castle. Okay, cool. Interesting. What else in this barrel? A barrel? We should break it! Oh, hopefully we get some loot. You never know what might be hiding inside a barrel. Fine. She takes the blade and smashes it to pieces. Something shimmers around the face. Ooh, five minor shards! There we go. Not a bad start. They're use highly useful, I can tell you very well. She grabs the shards and puts them into her belt pouch. You will encounter objects which can be broken o open for treasure as you proceed through the dungeon. To interact with objects, walk up and click on them. Minor shards are the primary currency of this dungeon. They're used to make magical items and pay for repairs. Oh, okay, cool. Now, can I change my actual view? Uh, I feel like... Oh well, let's go left then. <laughs> I was going to check... Um, uh, controls to see if there's a way to... Okay, I don't know. Let's continue. Oh, event! Let's check this out. 
Strange, I do not feel any fatigue while I'm down here. Monsters naturally recover quickly from wounds and tiredness. I've passed the most traits from you. Oh, cool. Well, I cannot complain about that. There is no healing magic in this game, as total party members regenerate health over time. Okay. For each turn of battle, or every two steps, a party member will recover health based on how much resilience they have. Okay, cool. If a monster's outfit is damaged, their recover rate is reduced by half. A monster's outfit is damaged when they take a critical hit and their current VP is lower than... Okay. So be sure to frequently visit town to recover. Okay. Alright, we need to talk to Elizabeth to repair outfits, we need to go town often to heal, if you remember that. Okay, cool. Oh, dead end. Oh, here we go. You can ad perform additional actions with the, with the uh, attract menu. Press right click or the R key. Alright, so you can escape battles. Having more AP increases your chance to escape. The longer a battle goes, the higher chance to escape. There are hot keys to access some of this action. Alright, A to do auto battle, S to speed up your current battle. Okay. Okay, so don't use it on hard battles, basically. Am I battling Bunny again? Looks like it. Oh, it's the AI doing it, it's like doing a demonstration. Oh, Bunny Girl's gonna get smashed again. Oh, can I use capture? Oh, I've got 10 more mana shards, awesome. Mana shards seem to be quite. Oh, here we go. That is the first floor of the dungeon. I knew you could do it. Well, it's only the beginning. I would not think too much about it. After all, it's best to take things one step at a time. I agree. One floor, one step, one battle. I do not know how deep this dungeon reaches into the earth, so I'm prepared for the worst. Go to the next floor? Yeah, let's go down. Oh, an event already, like straight away. If we keep th this place, we'll be through it in no time. Cool. If you keep doing it, you'll become overconfident. Yeah. If that happens, you'll underestimate your obstacles ahead. That is true enough. But even if I'm facing overwhelming odds, I have a stand. I have to stand firm. I gave up so easily whenever I faced some trouble that a what good would I be as an adventurer? So is that why you chose to keep fighting me instead of running away? Exactly. Ah, oh, she's admitting that everyone had the upper hand. But even so, I could not run away from you. That's nonsense, Siri. If there was a less bit of a monster trapped in the seal, you would have been sh you would have surely perished. No heroic sacrifice like that when you're working together, okay? I want us both to make it out of this dungeon alive. Oh, that's nice. Very well. I'll try not to. Thank you. Oh, if you if you're defeated, it's game over. What? Okay. You have gained experience or XP during your last battle. XP is gained for his attacking opponent, being attacked by an opponent, or when a character defeats an enemy. Okay. When an ally defeats an opponent, all party members, including members of the backline and the town, gain XP. That's cool. You gain additional XP when fighting against weakness, you gain less XP. Yeah, that makes sense. Oh, cool, leveling up. Alright, it's gonna level up here, I guess. Oh. Okay, she's on full health, so I'll do single slash. Okay. I'll do one more single slash and I hope I can catch her. Yep, 7. Oh, I'm 46, that's cool. Yay, I captured her! Woo! I got 10 mana shots. We have our first ally. But are you sure that Robert's is going to be not much use to us? You underestimate the Robert. There are particular species of fan in the windswept plateaus to the north. While they seem harmless enough, they have a natural affinity with the wind. Cool. They can tear you apart without having to touch you themselves. Ooh. What an unusually vicious rabbit. I suppose it's a good thing they are on our side now. Yep. Okay. Yeah, captured my first party member. If you want to add her to your dungeon party, head back to town and click on meet captured monsters at the main menu. Okay. How do I head back to town, I wonder? Oh, here we go. A oh, whoopstone. Okay, I'm gonna head back to town, and I'm gonna end the video here. So we're at town. When we when we come back, we'll go back into the dungeon and we'll continue on. 
So I hope you're enjoying this series. It's it's an interesting game. I've never played anything like this before. Um, I was just thinking as well. If you're watching the video and you like this and you like, we're gonna do the whole series. So if you want to see the rest of these secure dungeon ones, if you could press the subscribe button, that'd be cool. Thank you. Bye.